if you would have told me that here in the year 2024, I would be standing here in some hotel room in God knows where Kansas, about to solve one of the greatest mysteries the world has ever seen, I would have told you, wow, I can't believe it. That was a real reaction there. That was a genuine real reaction. Now you may be confused, maybe wondering, wait, why is Lunchables in the thumbnail? Does the mystery really pertain to Lunchables? And yes, absolutely it is. For years, there's been growing civil wars online and in my streets when I was growing up about how you handle the pepperoni pizza Lunchables. The question is simple. Do you A, microwave them so they can be warm, a little soft and delicious? Or B, do you eat it cold? Raw, disgusting, sloppy. You see me, I've always eaten them microwaved. I thought you were supposed to microwave them. I mean, I'm not one who really enjoys cold pizza. I mean, I know people eat my, like Little Caesar straight from the fridge, but it's like, I think you're kind of a, uh, an animal if you do that, if I'm gonna be brutally honest with you. But I've seen people just eat cold Lunchables pizza, even when a microwave was clean and available for them. They said, no, that's gross. Why would you do that? Still to this day, there is no clear answer as to what you were really supposed to do until I came along. I need to solve this mystery. So today on the Dumarachi channel, we are going to find out what it takes to have the perfect Lunchables pizza. Does it require a microwave or not? Oh yeah, there I am looking sexy. Okay, seriously, the reason I'm in the hotel is super simple. It's just for my job. I have a life outside of YouTube. Whoa, who would have thought? I haven't eaten the Lunchables in a long ass time, and this question still persists me. What is the true answer to this mystery? So, follow me. First person mode activate. <gasps> okay, so listen here, look at this. Got a little refrigerator here, got a little microwave, all right? Now inside this microwave, I got some donuts, but don't worry about that. I got two things of Lunchables pizza with the Capri Sun and the Crunch. Can't forget the Crunch and the Capri Sun. And since these are kid foods, I decided to have a kid drink to go along with it. Yes, I know I got a Capri Sun and another Capri Sun, but I want more. Oops. I haven't, I don't like Prime, but it's on sale at Walmart. And I was like, okay, just for the content. I've only had one Prime my entire life and I hated it. Not because of the people that are attached to it because I, I thought it legitimately tasted like ass, but this is Glowberry. The other one I had was Ice Pop. So maybe this one will be better. Hydration drink. Yeah, sure. So, okay, let's make the cold one. Actually, no, we're gonna make the hot one first. Okay, let's make the hot one. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Ooh, naughty, naughty. I broke the, I broke the tray. Little spilly. <laughs> oh, sorry. All right, let's put down one napkin first since we're gonna be working with sauce. All right, so we get one, two, three pizzas, all right? Yeah, so I'm about to eat six pizzas here tonight, plus two Capri Suns, plus two Crunches, plus some Prime, and I do have donuts in there that I know I'm gonna want later. I'm a fat ass. So first thing you gotta do is you gotta put the sauce on because that's how pizza's traditionally made. Oh, 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 oh. Technically this can be a cooking with Rachi episode, um, but we're not gonna consider this a cooking with Rachi because I, I'm, just, I'm just microwaving it. Oh shit, I'm running out of sauce. I still got another pizza. Oh, I got distracted. Hold on. Okay, I got like barely any sauce. So we're gonna like spread the love a little, okay? There we go. Okay, and since I don't have any, I'm just gonna use this to kind of like, you know, just kind of smear it around. <laughs> That's gonna be our little, we're gonna smear it, you know? We're just gonna, hmm? let's respect the smear, you know? Respect the smear with the pepperoni that's falling apart. Oh my God. I can barely get any cheese with this. Oh my goodness. That looks like Japanese symbols I just made. All right. Look, this is as good as it's gonna get. I made a mess. I made a messy. Oh, I hope my dad doesn't see this. <laughs> you get roughly like three pepperonis per pizza, all right? Hopefully this will be enough. 
Might as well throw the crunch bar on there for a little extra flavor. But there we go. We got we got three little pizzas made. <laughs> this was a fucking ordeal. Uh, I'm gonna throw these babies in the microwave and then we're gonna wait the other ones. But I'm gonna make those off camera because this took way too long and they need both of my hands. So be back in a second. Okay, that was pretty annoying, but it's done. I may I'm we're gonna microwave these instead because these look a lot more nicer. So these are gonna be the microwave ones. And these I just made earlier on camera. <laughs> these will be the uh, ones we're just gonna eat. Just write that. That was actually really annoying, and I'm not looking forward to having to take these all out. So let's close it. Now, how long do you usually put these things in here for? It's a very good question. We're gonna put this at probably about a minute. I think it's a minute, right? What kind of fucking dial is this? is right. Oh! Oh. Oh, baby. Oh. All right. Well, here we are. I finally have the Lunchables pizza here. Here is the delicious microwaved pizza. And here is the regular gross not cooked pizza. So I'm going to, I guess I'm going to eat. I'm hungry. Let's eat. Look at that. Cheese! Man, I was hungry as hell. I did not think I was gonna eat that entire thing in like one bite. I would rate that a seven out of 10. That was like, that was perfect. The sauce was warm. The cheese melted. The crust, soft, chewy, delicious. And now we're gonna eat the regular one. Could it really be that good? Look at that. It's depressing. This thing's gonna fall apart. It's not made to be like that. It's supposed to like be blended together in a warm cacophony. Here we go. Oh. 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 Oh, no. Oh, that's not, that's really not, it's, it's really not that good. Let's roll it. Mm. It's really not that good. Oh. oh, it's really not that good. Mm. Mm. I would give that maybe a six out of 10. Just put it in the microwave if you have one. Before I go though, I completely forgot. We got Prime in this bitch, thumbnail. Okay, that, that sucked. All right, we got fresh Prime. Can we get in there? Can we get in there? Hold on, yep. We got Glowberry Hydration Drink Prime. Let's take a look in there. Ooh, baby. Oh, that looks, that looks yummy to drink. Great. All right, well, let's see what Logan Prime, oh, Logan Prime. All right, let's see KSI's and Logan Paul's primordial fluids taste like. Got coconut water, D alpha. What? It's ten percent coconut water in here. It's a drink. Why are kids going crazy over this? I don't know. I don't feel hydrated. I feel like just ate candy. I think it's super simple. I mean, you can eat lunchables the way you want to eat lunchables. I'm not gonna judge you. You want me to judge you? I'm, I won't judge you about that. Like, I get it. Maybe a microwave is available and that's just how you're gonna have to eat it. Whatever, dude. But if you're at home, put that shit in the microwave. Put that shit in the air fryer, even. I bet that's just probably amazing. I don't understand how people can put this in a microwave and then go back to eating it cold. It was chalky. The cheese, I, I might as well be eating like, like crumbs off the floor. And the pepperoni, I was like eating slime. It's a crime against humanity, honestly. But I guess mystery solved. See you guys next week on Unsolved Mysteries, where we're gonna do more mysteries being solved. Is this actually gonna be a series I'm gonna do? Probably not, because this was not a, this was not a good debut episode.